I'm Eric. I have been in private practice since 2015. And before that, I worked in various government agencies, working with children, vulnerable adults. I worked with foster kids. I've worked in adoptions. And then in 2015, I had some reasons to move on my own and go private. So I've been in the private practice setting since 2015. And then a colleague of mine who used to supervise me back in government actually recruited me and she really talked it up and everything she said about Mindful was even better than expected. I'm still in the onboarding process and I'm about three or four weeks in. I work primarily with the higher functioning adults who are trying to overcome depression and anxiety and I'm pretty good at it. And I'm really excited to be partnering up with Mindful so that they can help encourage and help support the administrative part so I can just focus on that. My anxieties were mostly in terms of like the different way of documentation um, using the advanced MD system. I don't use that right now. So it's a bit of a learning curve there. But then the onboarding team showed me how to use the uh, Mindful Support Services app. And I've been tinkering around with that the last week. And those fears have been pretty much assuaged. I won't know exactly until you know, my boots hit the ground in August. But for right now though, I, I feel pretty good. So I am most excited about the fact that I'll have administrative support and it's very streamlined and it's very provider friendly. It's very provider focused. And that makes me very, very happy because I feel like I have a team and I feel like I have people that really care about our well-being as well as our clients. I'm excited to have that because I've not had that before. I've contracted with probably half a dozen other agencies over the years, and I never had that. It was always pretty much just me on my own and my own forms and my own protocols in place and everything was just me. So it's really, really helpful to have a lot of support that's effective, that works. I know it works because there's like hundreds of other providers on Mindful and I have a great person who recruited me who swears by it and loves it and continues to. So I'm excited. I don't think there's anything like Mindful from what I've seen. I mean, I've got, I've been doing this line of work since about 2000 for government and also on my own since 2015. And like I said before, I've contracted with several other big providers, both international and also local. And I've never seen anything like Mindful, the level of organization and the how provider centric it is and how organized and well managed it is. I'm just amazed about the support through that app. I just poked around that Mindful Support Services app the other day, and I was just blown away by all the features in it, you know, from uploading a new profile picture to learning how to use Advanced MD and everything in between. I haven't seen anything like it. I also like the idea that we're able to get paid what we're worth. And I'm also really excited that Mindful does all of the insurance paneling for us, because that I know is an onerous task and it's one of the things that I think burns a lot of therapists out in this business is having to do all the legwork with the insurance companies. So, and Mindful does an exemplary job of that. It's, it's been pretty amazing. <laughs> I was really excited to meet other providers and also meet the founders as well in the series. It was really, really cool to listen to them and basically, you know, learn that they have our backs and that uh, there's this open dialogue, open communication back and forth. I was excited to hear that they're interested in, in our thoughts and what we were interested to do to benefit and also to improve on ourselves as well as for mindful too. I was grateful to have, be able to provide feedback. <laughs> 